another custom home which i tried maybe at least approximately after four years at least four years because it was one of the best rooms while i was using the android 6 7 8 and now i tried this room in android 12.1 which is this custom room i'll talk about this later on in this video so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end if you don't know about this custom room then i don't think so you are too 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 old in custom room community maybe if i talk about the things of course with the quick settings panel you already got to know that which custom room i'm talking about but if you still didn't got make sure to watch this i will tell you later on if i move on to the things you can see just saw the quick settings brightness slider looks quite good something different something unique if i move on to the default launcher here you have a better options of course we have the icon pack support if you want to use any other icon pack you can by the way it's not pixel based the ui is already telling you that because it it has very kind of square kind of ui instead of the rounded one which you can customize of course but we're not going to talk about that we have google search bar related things a double tap to sleep is also present i think some few of the features are already there if i move on to the app drawer if you're able to see some things for example you can see the icon pack is from lineage by the way i'm using this as an unofficial build i'm not i'm not sure if it is available for your device or not you can go and search for it but if you want to install it on me 11x at least or poco f3 redmi k4 because this is my new device you can install this thing for sure and i will try to provide the link for that other than else as you can see if i move on to the settings app it will not give you any kind of uniqueness anywhere because in some customs like descendant sikra you have unique features but in this one we don't have that but other than else things are kind of really interesting like wallpapers and style it has a modern theme as expectedly it was expected it's their themed icons you can enable if you want to but it will give you some features which are quite good i think some extra features some new features which you have and this is where i will tell you that which is the custom room i'm talking about gestures extra swipe to screenshot as expectedly everything is already there system navigation has this option where you can hide the navigation bar pill if you want to but if you don't want that you can enable that too and here we have the aicp extras which means yes this is the custom room i'm talking about this is AICP Android and by the way uh, in previous times when I tried to use this AICP guest room that room was quite good and it was beating Resurrection Remix at that time it was competing with that room but right now it's not of course if, even if it is not available officially for any device maybe if I'm not wrong power menu has basic options available for you we have some keys customizations buttons and gestures some status bar customizations as expectedly and and as I just mentioned, it was compatible with the Resurrection Mix at that time. Not right now. Even Resurrection Mix will not give you Android 11. So far, it's not giving. They still have Android 10. And here we have Google releasing Android 13 right now. So yes, it's been a long time. Resurrection Mix was quite good. AICP is actually quite good too. AICP is the worst custom which I'm talking about in this video. As I just mentioned, if you want to install this unofficial build on advice, you can. Link is available there. And some of these are things I just want to let you know thanks for watching i'll see you next video goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through